<laughs> now let's chat about International Being You Day. It's literally a day to be authentically yourself, whether it's weird, quirky, bougie, sporty, just be you, okay? We should do it every day, but we are making sure to highlight it today. So I brought my girl Nicole DaCosta on to chat about how we can celebrate some self-love and celebrating just ourselves. Yes, hello, I came as myself today. <laughs> Very happy to be here. <laughs> I love that. So we do have some suggestions for everyone out there. Yes. So First, let's start by doing something today that you've always wanted to do. I, I mean, you, checking off kind of that bucket list, but you've never dared to actually do it. That's This is really who you are on the inside, I feel like. Well, that's not going to be me in that photo, I'll tell you that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to keep it down on the ground, but like, I think it'd be fun to sign up for like a dance class or yeah. just like do something fun with friends and, you know. Something kind Absolutely. of fun and embarrassing, yes. Oh, I would, I would like a dance class, but I'm also, I'm like that. That could you do it? I, I think I could. Okay, that's authentically well, you. Going, I don't know if you guys remember when we first started the show. Going, yeah. uh, uh, oh, you went ATV. Oh, the snow. Yes. yes. Oh my god. That gosh. was way outside of my comfort zone. <laughs> like light years outside of my comfort zone. <laughs> when but you I did it, up. yeah, yeah. and yeah. it was so much fun. Yeah. So I, I might go back snowboarding. Yes. Yes. Because we, See, we did the fun. yeah the little snow ATVs thing, whatever. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so that would be funny. Okay, but this next suggestion, why not watch videos about how to step into being even Ooh. more of you? Oh, this is so fun. What would the video be about? Kind of self-love and okay. how you can, you know, sometimes we uh, give ourselves to, to people too yes. much. And then yes. we don't have enough to fill up our own cup. No, it's true. I think we all do that, especially yeah. as women. At the end of the day, it's kind of like, oh, wait, <laughs> let's do something for myself, you know. <laughs> so I think that's a great one just to take some time yeah. or read a book or just You can't give it all away. Out. You got to keep some, and keep the good stuff for yourself, yeah. too, you know. Yeah, um, and, schedule it for yourself. Yes. Yeah, and we can also give ourselves a judgment break. Oh. I know you and I have this in common. We you know, do. What if May 22nd could be a day where you just did not judge yourself for anything? I know, because we try to be perfectionists and we work so hard and do so many different things that we're really hard on ourselves. We're our harshest critic. Yes, and we don't need to be. We're nice, fun people. And, think, and speaking <laughs> of videos, you know, yes. we squirrel on social media all the time. Yes. I heard someone say, talk to yourself like you are your friend. Yeah. And when you start to get down on yourself, you would tell somebody if they were talking about your best friend like that, don't talk about yeah, you my gotta, friend. You gotta check them, yeah. Don't, yeah, you know, yeah. so you almost like check yourself. You know, we almost do that to each other. Yeah. <laughs> I'll be like, we this do. was so good, what are you talking about? You're like, I don't, and I do the same thing. Yep. So that's so funny. We oh, absolutely that is nice. Do. Yeah. I think we should practice these. This shouldn't just be one day. This should be something we carry it forward. It should, it yeah. should. But we're just putting it on everyone's mind <laughs> today, <laughs> time. If you want to jump out of an airplane, you do you. <laughs> but we can also write down three things that are different about us and that yes. we're grateful for and post it on social media. We yes. post everything else on social. Yes. Why not brag on yourself? Yes, and being grateful. Good things come when you are a grateful person and yeah. you're, you're you're happy or acknowledging. You know yes. what I mean? Because we're all so fortunate and there's just things that we don't, we, we can overlook, but we're all pretty blessed. So. And I also feel like words are very powerful. Yes. So, and especially when you write them down, even yes. with your goals and things like that. Ugh. So if you're writing down things that you're grateful for and yes. things that you recognize in yourself that are kind of like <laughs> highlight you and distinguish yes. you from everyone else, I think that you'll just step into that more and yes. become that even more. Um, and it'll just reflect in oh, your life. See, that's where we're, we're hard on ourselves. If I, I write it down, I have to do it. It's like and a it's crazy. Commitment. I can say that about Nicole, but then some <laughs> Sometimes I'm like, Dom, I'm not saying that about myself. And then vice versa. Where, you know. Oh, typical. <laughs> absolutely. Where, I mean, the yin to my yang. I know. <laughs> Being you, Dave, this is so fun. I never heard about it, but I think it should be kind of like every weekend. So. Yeah. We should make it like a whole month. Okay. Yeah. We should set a little list of goals. We should. Okay. And we can be each other's accountability okay. partner. Make your best friend your accountability partner for Be You Day. Yes, make me go to the gym. And also, <laughs> I'll drive you there. Okay. And then tag us on social media because we would really like to know what makes you, you, and why you're so grateful for it. I think that's yes. perfect. Yes. Oh, yes. such a good day. Yeah. Okay, can't wait to see what you come up with. All everybody. right, guys. It's